You know, right now, we're going to start from scratch. You know, we're going to start over teaching, um, you know, start f developing leaders, getting bigger, stronger, and faster. And the plan is right now is to come back, figure out what district we're going to be in, build our team through those four phases that we've talked about, and, and try to go win the whole thing. That's what we're planning on doing year three. Well, the, the game had a lot, of, a lot of expectations, a lot of high emotions. I felt like our players were prepared. I felt like they were ready to accept the challenge and, and, and ready to go out and perform their best because it was required. Um, we started off a little shaky, had a few more three and outs than I expected and coming away with no points. Uh, once the guys kind of settled down, we started to do some really great things and started to expose the defense and finishing with some points and, and seizing that momentum. And as the game went on, I just felt like we were losing the battle in the big plays. We, we didn't make the plays that we needed to make um, in the air or running wise to, to break the game open and really, really capture that, that momentum that we needed and, and, and we lost, we lost right there. Well, I just let them, let them know how much I, I loved them and appreciated their effort. You know, it's all of them were hurting, uh, especially the seniors, but all of them were really hurting because we had some high expectations for this season. Losing that game wasn't, wasn't part of the plan. And, um, you know, they, they gave so much effort all year I couldn't be more proud of the football team. Best football team I've ever been a part of. I appreciate you guys. You younger guys remember this feeling. That, and remember what those seniors did to get us to this point. The sacrifices that were made, they're worth it. These are the type of atmospheres that we're able to play in as, as a football team. When you do the summer workouts and you show up in the spring and you take care of your business in the classroom, all of this, all of the, this whole thing, all the success we've had this season, it, it, it comes from what you do on a day-to-day day day basis. Proud of you guys. Love each and every single one of you. Listen, you seniors, you seniors, you got me for life. Our relationship ain't over with just because you graduated. You guys understand that. Well, you know, it was it was a pretty concrete way of moving forward and having to individually peel apart each goal that you set out to to get every game. It just really gave me that vivid image that hey, you know, we did well, but it's time to move forward and and just taking off those things and knowing that okay, well, it makes you hungry. That's a uh... That's the worst part of, of coaching is is going through the, the start over is because uh, it's the end of, of the season you just had and especially when you have a season like we had, it uh, it makes it really tough and uh, tearing those stickers off the board is, is not fun. It's not fun to have to start cleaning up your team books and your play scripts and you know your call sheets and um, you know. And uh, this group of seniors um, is one of the most fun hardworking, um, you know, just just an unbelievable group of kids. And I think in, in talking to some of our underclassmen, um, they wanted to win this not for themselves and not for their coaches, but for these seniors. And I, and I felt the same way. I wanted to win not for myself and not for the fellow coaches, but for this senior group and the, the work that these kids had put in. And they were the group that, you know, had truly bought into what we were selling. And we had an unbelievable off season in spring and summer and fall camp. And, um, they are just a, a phenomenal group of kids, um, and so you know you just you just hug them and, and tell them how much you love them, and uh, that this doesn't end our relationship. You know that this is this is the beginning of our relationship, not the end. <laughs>